Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have two very special guests, my lovely boyfriend Pavel and his best friend Gleb. In today's video, they will be rating popular perfumes on the market on a scale of 0 to 10. 0 being really really disgusting, they wouldn't recommend it. 10 being extremely delicious, sexy perfume. Um, and they will also be giving you their thoughts so this can help you pick out which perfumes you might want to buy if you've been looking and you couldn't really decide which one you want to get they might help you out a little bit keep in mind though that scent is very subjective to each person and some guys might read it differently but today you will get their opinion anyways let's keep this intro short and let's move on to the video let's do it yeah. let's go Okay. Okay, so we have our very first perfumes. You guys go ahead and smell it. And we will start with Pavel. Let's start with Pavel. Next round we'll start with Club. I like it. Okay. It's like a 7.3. Okay. But this is the first one, so keep yeah. in mind. Maybe I'll change my opinion. But yeah, it's right now it's a 7.3. Oh, I need to write the score down. <laughs> okay, wait. Um, you know. I picture this with a nice summer date, you know, spring, summer, May, May, 21 degrees Celsius, mm -hmm. girls wearing a nice dress by the lake, okay. something like that. It's nice, 7.3, very nice, fruity, okay. cheerful. But, what about you? Um, not the biggest fan. I think, really? uh, I, I feel like if you put too much of this perfume, it's going to ruin Ooh. it. Don't put too much of this stuff. I agree. Okay, so it's strong. I also feel like it's something like, like an older person would wear, like really? an older woman. I don't see it like like a younger girl wearing that. I don't know, it's just my opinion, but... Huh, interesting. interesting. That's what it is. Okay. Uh, like, how would you rate it from 0 to 10? Uh, I'd say like 7.5. 7 7.5? Yeah, it's not a so bad I, one. So you gave it a higher rating than me and I liked it more than you. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's not a bad one. I'm just saying I feel like it's not some somebody okay. that would wear our age. I have yeah. to say, this was my first ever perfume. I was. It's still from Hungary, so I was, I think... Oh, 1.1 1. 1 out of 10. 11 years old when I got this perfume and I thought it was so delicious. And I still have it and it still... It smells good. Anyways, so this perfume was Mel Mario. I actually don't really know the name. I don't know if you can still get this because it's a really old perfume, as I said, but it smells really good in my opinion. Let's move on to the next one. Ready? Yes. All right, here we go. Second perfume. Wait, I went first, okay? So yeah, you go. so okay. next time... Yeah, you're gonna start. All right. Hmm. I like this one more than, than the other one. Okay. I, I really How like this... How would you rate it? And then mm. tell me what you think of this perfume. Just give me a second. This one has a very warm, kind of bubbly smell. I, I, I um, agree, yeah. I would give, I would definitely give it a, around 8 out of 10, okay. for sure. It's higher than the other one, but... Again, too much perfume can get can be too much. Maybe like a 1, you know, they call it. Yeah, it's a strong one, yeah. so... A little is good enough. But I like it, yeah. It's okay. pretty good. So 8 out of 10, yeah. what, what about, about you? you? It's too sweet. It reminds me of a strip club. <laughs> okay. I think a stripper named Cinnamon or something would wear something like this. Um, it's a little too sweet, so like a 6.1 out of 10. Okay, you don't like sweets? No, I'm not the biggest fan of sweets. It's, it's a weird sweet, like it's it. a fake sweet. It's not even a natural sweet. It's just, I don't know, it just reminds me of a stripper for some reason. <laughs> okay. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Don't buy this, guys. Girls, so it's I don't not know. a fan. No, not you a like fan. This more I like this. Maybe one. even like 5.1. 5.1. I'm changing my answer. I, I don't like this one. I don't like this one. 5.1? 5.1. Okay. Don't buy this. Okay. You're getting scammed. So Unless you work in the strip club industry, then. Yeah, I like it. Alright, so all means. this perfume was Black Musk by the Body Shop. It's actually not a perfume, it's a body oil. It lasts forever. Body oil? It's perfect. That's oil. cheating! No, it's a perfume, but in an oil form, so it lasts much longer. And you only need a little dab. It's a really good quality for a really good price, okay? I'll link all the perfumes down below in the description. We'll move on to the next one. Okay. Ready? Yep. Here we go. All right, let's try this Ooh, one. Ooh, this one's my style. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> That's good, right? I this, told you it's Mmm. Maybe you don't like it. Uh, I like it. Mmm. This is an 8.6, 8.7. 8.7. 8. 
this is the best one so far for sure. Okay. So, eight point one? eight point six. Okay. Really. Good. This is um very summery, very summery. You don't, you would definitely not wear this in the winter time. Mm -hmm. very, very summery. Good. I picture myself drinking sangria to this. It's very nice, very very nice. Maybe even like going to a vacation like Dominican resort, it's whatever. Refreshing. Very refreshing. Perfect work yeah. to describe. Love it. Love yeah, it. Love yeah. it. Love it. Top one so far. I agree with that with everyone. Uh, it's very refreshing, <laughs> like like a, like an oceanic kind of um, smell. You know, it's very yeah. Again, summery. Uh, so yeah, I'll give it definitely around eight, eight out of ten for sure. Eight out of ten. Okay. Oh, that's a good one, Fawn. Yeah, I like it's it. It's really good. All right. So it is Versace Bright Crystal. I don't have the full bottle. It's actually a roller ball. Ah, oh, we picked that one yes, out. That's I the roller ball. I'm so smart. I picked it out. See. <laughs> Next one. Who's yeah, this is good with like a rubashka with a shirt. No, it's a it's women's perfume. <laughs> you I, also wear it. I would wear it for myself. Really? Yeah. You should try. Sometimes it's good. I feel like it's like oh. a it's like a Miami. No, there's better. It's it's a Miami. We should style. do men's cologne next. I should. I told you. Right? I should bring mine. We should yeah. do men's cologne. Yeah. Men's edition too. Okay. This one is a really different from the last. Okay, one. you're Let's going first. See. Ooh, that's a strong one, eh? <laughs> Zero, zero, uh, burn this. So <laughs> was it your turn? I don't care. Uh, zero, yeah. zero. <laughs> Why is this allowed? Ban it. Is this oh, sexy? <laughs> it's so I think head. it's a sexy. Where's the coffee beans? Um, <laughs> oh, I never want to remember oh, no, that no, no, smell no, no, in my no, life. First, zero. Yeah. How would you? I yeah, I I don't like it as much as he. Uh, I mean, he hates it the most. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it as much as the other ones, but uh, I'd, I'd give it around like 6 out of 10. Okay, that's not that 6 bad. out of 10. It's probably, yeah, it's, some, it's not something you wear every day. It's something like It's maybe, something you wear never. Yeah, well, yeah. Never, sure. never put this on. I think it's really sexy. A very confident woman should wear this perfume. No, really no, strong. no, no. Okay, you tell me your thought. Uh, somebody who has absolutely zero taste in perfume would wear this. Somebody who, <laughs> I don't know, lacks a nose would wear this. Um, I don't know. This, is the, this is the worst thing I've ever smelled in my life. Like, I've smelled dog poo and this okay. is worse. Like, like saying goodbye. Your nose buds realigned and re scrubbed. And yes, you just, need to be uh, hit in the head <laughs> and you need to realign everything. How this, would you rate this? Zero. It's a zero. It's a zero. Burn it. Burn it and remove it from the store. So literally zero. Whatever company yeah, made this needs to be sued. Like, I have trauma. Like, I need to smell the coffee beans again. Alright. Oh, okay. Can so, Avoid this at all costs. So guys, this was Rihanna's Revel. It's very strong. One <laughs> spray is enough and it will last you the whole day. And it's really good price too. But they don't like it. I personally like it. Never but wear only, it. I would say it's more for winter time on a very special occasion. Yeah, I agree. It's like a yeah. winter time. Like Christmas. Thing. Please never wear this around me. <laughs> Alright, let's go on to the next one. Hope it's better. <laughs> Alright. No, I'm not giving you 10. Nobody's giving you 10. One. There's no such thing as perfect. Perfume. I mean, Pavel is going first. Um, it's nice. I would say it's it's like a worse version of the third one, the Versace one. It's very similar to that one. Oh, okay. And I would, it's like, you know, you have a Ferrari, but then you have a Mercedes. So this would be the Mercedes and the last one would be a Ferrari. So, you know, 7.4, 7.5. Nothing special though. Nothing. Not, nothing about this... I wouldn't remember somebody wearing this. I wouldn't care. You know, it's it's a perfume. That's all it is to me. It's it's, it's whatever. Okay. I don't know. Not nothing crazy. Nothing to doesn't doesn't uh, evoke any emotions in me. Doesn't do anything. Would for you me. say the Versace does? Yeah, the Versace okay. reminds me of a good time. Okay, well, yeah, I, I agree. It's not the. Uh, it, it doesn't like. You're not gonna really remember this perfume when you see somebody. I mean, I would wear it if I was a girl. I would wear it maybe on the first date, one time, and then maybe switch it because. <laughs> It's not something you want to wear every day. Um, again, it's not really memor memorable, but uh, it's not bad. I'll give it. It's something you wear to work. It's like yeah, a, yeah, maybe like an interview or yeah, something. Yeah, it's an everyday wear, perfume. It's like yeah, whatever. like, like you, wear, you would wear with a suit, maybe you know, like like an office kind of yeah. environment. So yeah. that means it's a good perfume. No, it's, no, 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 yeah, no, no, but we're not no. saying it's bad. Um, I would give maybe like a yeah, seven out of seven, it, it, seven it, out of ten. Yeah, it's very, it's average. It's the definition of average. Yeah. So All right. I do agree. It's a very everyday kind of perfume. Yeah, this perfume is Ariana Grande's perfume called Cloud. It's very popular, very long lasting, perfect for the money that it's being sold for. Let's go on to the next perfume.
Okay, guys, here we go. All right. Ooh. I like it. I like it. Um. <laughs> she's not gonna agree with me. No, I'm just letting um, you speak your mind. Yeah, definitely for um, some, you know, like a millennial, somebody who's millennial, around, you know, around thirty year old. Um, well, it's uh, it, it's it's something you would wear more often. Um, really, like an everyday? Not an everyday, but. You know, it's, uh, yeah, it's, I like it. it. I would definitely give it around 8 out of 10, for sure. Mm. It's something with, it's refreshing, you know, you don't really get dizzy from smelling it. Oh, so, good. yeah, I, I would, I, I, I think it's my top three for sure, for now. It, it is actually, yeah. based on the score. Yeah. I'm going to put my uh, life on the line here, and I'm pretty sure she wears this a lot. Think so? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm like 98% sure she wears this a lot. It's a good one. Oh? Yeah, see, it's a good. It is a good one. She chooses a good one. It's a good one. It's like uh, I don't know. I feel like I'm a little biased because yeah. I smell this so much. So it's a good one though. It is a good I one. I haven't worn this lately for a few months now actually. But I remember it. See, yes, so it's fancy. so the there we go. So uh, she hasn't worn it in a while, but I strongly remember it. it brings back strong emotions. So it's a good one. So I agree. It's it's around an eight, maybe seven point nine, eight point one, whatever you want to put down. It's a yeah. good one. Around that day, it's, right? it's a good one. It's a good uh, 7.9. It's a good one. 7.9? It's, it's a 7.9. It's a good one. I wonder when you're going to put 10. Nothing's getting a ton. Okay. 10 is a hard one. All Nothing's right. getting a ton. So this perfume is one of my personal favorites from YSL Black Opium. Black Opium. The one, one your mom wanted. Yeah, it's, it's a good one. It's so a good one. sexy, long lasting, very, it's a sexy perfume. <clears throat> Very good for a night out, I would say. Like exactly. Wear, yeah, yeah. Like a club or a yes. bar. Yes. It's so sexy. It's fun. It's fun. That's a good way. You want to yeah. make I out want, with this girl. Yeah. You yeah, want to yeah, you you sure. you take shots with this girl. You want to <laughs> make out with her. You want to bring her home. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Next one. Oh yeah. Okay. Wait. Give me. Yeah. Wait, wait. Sniff those beans. We're gonna sniff those beans. No. No, 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 no. This smells like Febreze. This is a 1 out of 10. There's no comments. It's a Febreze. This is what I would use to freshen my toilet, <laughs> my washroom. 1 out of 10. Garbage. 1 out of 10. 1 out of 10, that's a Febreze. That's not even perfume. That's Febreze. Uh, I don't care. Do it's Febreze. Uh, I can't, she's scamming us. It's I a can't trick. hate it too much. It's definitely something you don't, you, it's, you don't wear every day. I don't even know when you would wear that, to be honest. Like, what's Since you said Febreze, now it, it, it smells like Febreze, but... It's kind of refreshing at the same time. It is. Like I, I wouldn't. It's very I mean, I, I don't think. I agree, but it's not a perfume. It's Febreze. It's a toilet Look, freshener. I, yeah, I, I definitely wouldn't give it too much. Uh, maybe like a six out of ten. Okay. You know what it reminds me of when you walk into the mall bathrooms, like Sherway Gardens or Yorkdale. Yeah, That's what their bathrooms yeah, well, smell like. Literally like this. It's a bathroom it's, air freshener. It's yeah, definitely. Uh, I can see that. It's, it's a refresher. It's, it's not a perfume. Yeah. This is the trick. You know, she inserted the air freshener as a trick. She just didn't tell us. <laughs> okay, yeah. so guys, this was actually a body mist, a strawberry scented body mist from the Body Shop. It smells so good. Only ten dollars. Man, Body Shop's gonna sue us. One downside to this: it doesn't last long. You actually have the exact same shower gel. I just saw really? it in the washroom. Oh wow. It's in strawberry. It smells so good. I think this reminds oh. you of the very first one, Mel Marino. See, it's not perfumes. The ones it's, that are not perfumes. It's it doesn't like, last long though. The ones that are not perfumes are not good. Okay, so this was a no-no for both of them. Let's move on to the next one. Let's go. Dog is gonna join the chat. Yes. Hmm. Okay. One sec with me. Go. Yeah. This one's not bad. I like it. It's uh, very. Uh, <laughs> it's sweet. <laughs> I like this. It's one. fruity. That's a, that's the definition oh, I gave it. Yes. It's a fruity one. I like um, this one. I like this one. Yeah, it, it reminds me of like a very like um, warm atmosphere and somewhere in Caribbeans. You know, people are just partying. Yeah. Very fruity. Very sweet. Uh, yeah, definitely give it around. 8.5. Wow. That's probably one of the best that's ones. That's the highest for Glenn. You agree? Um, I, it has a lemon citrusy feel to it, which I love. I love the lemony. Mm -hmm. It's very fruity. It's very light. But for some, I don't associate it with the Caribbeans. I associate it with a very successful person. Wow. 
I when I smell this, I picture somebody I don't know, like a CEO wearing this. Oh. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know, like a CEO, like a very uh, yeah. yeah, like a party atmosphere. No, I picture oh. like a very uh, like I'm going into an interview with a CEO. You know, I like I like a power woman. That's what I associate the smell <laughs> with the lemon. Maybe it's the citrus because cit lemons are so strong, right? <laughs> Put it on your tongue, and you're like. Ooh! I like it, I like it. It's definitely 8.2, 8.2. 8.2 top 3 8. for sure. Definitely top, this is after Versace. Versace done this. The oh, other, nice. the Versace and these ones are in a totally different category. Like, honestly, I'd probably take a point off all the other ones. All right. Good? It's good, it's good. It's good. All right. Which so one is it? This was Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. This is the last perfume I got with you, actually. When did we get this that? This is the one from your, the, 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 your dad's gift card. Oh, yes. so <gasps> I picked that one out with you too. Yes, this is Yo, I one of I pick out good perfumes. I, I watch a lot of YouTube videos. <laughs> Every guy likes this and rates them one of the highest perfumes. It's really citrusy, very refreshing, good for summer. I wouldn't say it's a winter scent, but really yeah, good. Yeah, definitely not a winter. I pick out. And this is the eau de toilette. I can't say it. Eau de toilette. Eau de toilette. And it's so strong. One spray or two sprays and I feel last you the whole day. So we definitely recommend. We do, we do, we do. Okay. Next perfume, guy. <laughs> All right, let's try it. Mmm. <laughs> so yeah, what do you think? I definitely like it a lot. It's very tropical, very warm uh, kind of smell. Uh, it's Again, it's something that I haven't smelled before. Uh, you know, before we we try it, so it's a unique. It's a you're very unique one. Yeah, that's right. It's very unique, and yeah, definitely, uh, I will give it around eight out of ten for sure. Okay. I wouldn't wear it in a club, though. I feel yeah, like it's, it's very, it's, it's a, woman's it's a very tropical, very like um, you Can know, you have to be in a in a warm place, and hmm, I like it. Well, <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's um. It's a daytime kind of uh, okay. perfume, not a nighttime, not a, like a date atmosphere, more like a date, you know, um, around like a kind of morning, afternoon kind of feeling. Okay. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't know what to think about this one. On one hand, it kind of reminds me of a hotel smell, air freshener again. <laughs> kind of gives off that air freshener vibe. On the other hand, I do smell the ocean, so I, I don't know. Oh, shit. I don't know, I guess if you want to like, yeah, it's, I don't know, maybe if I'm on a trip to Cuba, Dominican Republic, you know, like, it's, it's, you know, you're on yeah. your third day of the trip, it's 3 p.m., you want to go out to lunch, maybe you throw this on, why not? You just want to smell a little fresh, but, I don't know. It is what it is, 6.2, whatever. Six point. Oh, it's I just you would like mediocrity it. at its finest, it's a mediocre one. It's, it's yeah. definitely a unique one, right? It's unique, it is unique, but like, eh, whatever. Okay. Very interesting, guys. This is an old perfume. This is Britney Spears Circus, I believe. So mm. very generic. A lot of people wear this actually, um, but a lot of people like it. Really good price for this bottle. If you want to go ahead, it smells sweet. But to me, it's a little bit generic. Mm. But he he thinks it's unique. I like it. I, it's it, unique. It's, it's unique it's in comparison sweet. to what we smelled. Yeah, okay. That's what he I meant. believe we have one perfume that smells really similar to this, but we'll see what they think. Okay. All right. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, Billy is smelling it too. Yeah, the dog likes it. I don't know. I don't know. It's it's okay. It's fruity. It's it's summery. It smells like a cheap perfume, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know. It, I it, I wouldn't be surprised if this is another body shop one. Okay. Um, I don't know. Five point four out of ten. It, it's it's whatever. It's nice, you know. Again, it's maybe you wear it on a Caribbean vacation, or whatever. But that's about it. Wouldn't I don't know. That, that's all it does for me. This perfume literally, like, makes me think of a perfume store. This is like the perfume store smell. Okay. You come in, you smell this. Yes. I, I I don't hate it. I don't dislike it, but I don't know. It's just an average one, right? It's a, it's not the best one. Mm -hmm. mm, definitely you don't you don't wear this, wear this every day. Uh, something you would wear, I guess, on in a, in a on an interview or something like that. But 
Yeah, I'd say uh, 6.7 out of 10. Okay. So this perfume, this perfume was another Viasol. It's Mon Paris. Mon Paris. I don't know how to say Paris. it. Mon Paris. And I first discovered this when I was working in a restaurant and I saw this woman pass by me. I thought it was the most beautiful, sexiest scent. So I had to ask her and she told me. But to be honest, it doesn't smell the same as I smelled it on her. And it, you know, it works differently with uh, other people's body chemistry. So maybe that's why I smelled it different. Um, it is definitely an everyday scent. Um, a lot of people describe it as um, cheap, soapy. But to me, I really like it. It's very fruity, young, for, for young girls, it's amazing. Um, everyday scent for summer. See, cheap soap. But not sexy or anything. No, it's very no. Average very official. Scent. Very superficial. Yeah. It's just something you put official, on me for the sake of putting it on. It's yeah, like, okay, it's I need something to put on and I spray perfume. it on. But it's very pleasant in my opinion. So yeah. there you go, one curry. All right. Let's go to the next one. So, okay. There you go. Um, right. Gleb's turn. I'll go first. Yes. Oh man. What? <laughs> what is it? I don't like this. <laughs> this is literally a Febreze to me. <laughs> this <agree>. is. <laughs> man, I swear to God, my Russian apartment used this <laughs> in the toilet in oh. Russia. I swear to God. <laughs> this is literally a Febreze. No, man. What, what the You guys will be so surprised when I reveal this. Three me. out of ten. Okay. Three. Three. <laughs> Yeah, it's just, this is the worst for yeah, me. Yeah, it's like it's like uh, I don't know, four point one. It's whatever. It's whatever. It's, it's not something I don't I care for. I don't care for you it. You don't wear this, man. I don't know. It's just... is it this one. Yeah. Wow. I don't like maybe it. Maybe it looks. Yeah. Maybe it smells okay. better on. What um, is it? Tell us. So maybe it's better on skin. Maybe. But what is it? It is. Burberry, her London dream. It's a Burberry perfume. It smells really soapy. I would not like it personally either. Right, Pamela's turn. turn. Moving on to the next one. Let's go. Hmm. It's interesting. It's different for sure. I like it. I like it. It. It's. A kind of elegance. That's the word I would describe yeah. this. It's elegant. I could picture, I don't know, taking this to a big formal, like a ball. This is what you would wear to it. Um, you definitely want to wear this every day. Uh, it's a ball. It's very formal. It's not It's not an everyday perfume, that's for sure. It's very nice, though. It's, it's very nice. It's a 7.7, 7.6, 7.7, whatever. I don't know. Something around there. B+. Plus. So what it is? What is 7.7. It? Let's say 7.7. I like it, but it's very particular. It's only for certain occasions. Definitely not something you put on every day. Definitely not. Maybe like Thanksgiving dinner, Christmas dinner, something like that. Go, you go to church for Easter. I don't know, stuff like that. But definitely not like a date or out to the clubs, whatever. Just, it's elegant though. I like it. Elegant? Okay. It's elegant. That's the best way I can. Yeah, same here. I feel like this is uh, some, some, not something you wear at a club or, you know, like a... Um, romantic environment it's more like yeah like a professional environment so but i like it it's a very smooth smell it's not uh you know very strong so i'd give it around 7.8 out of 10 for sure i like it very close guys it's not bad can i smell it yeah. it's 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 a perfume i really like this to me it smells a little bit manly too yeah, I was gonna Don't say that. Don't you think it smells manly a little bit? That's what I'm saying. It's, it's very, very yeah. It's formal. It's, it's formal. It's a really unisex nice. kind. Of I like it. I actually really like it. And this was um, Gucci Flora Gorgeous Gardenia. Not surprised. Gucci. I love. I have Gucci cologne. I love Gucci. This smells really nice. Gucci is a nice cologne. Yeah, yeah. I really like it. I feel like it really depends on the person. Yeah. You, but anyway, so this is the what perfume. I don't have actually the right um, actual bottle, but it's the second one right here. I don't know if you see it. All right, next one. All right, let's try it. Still on my finger. Oh man, I don't know. I, I like this one. It's not bad, but it's strong. Yeah, that's that's what I was gonna say. It's not. That's exactly what I was gonna yeah, say. Yeah, yeah. You just uh, you spray once and that's it. You don't yeah. go too much. Do you? It's definitely something you would wear 
I can't picture wearing it like in a in a like a party environment. That's something again, something like a very formal kind of like an office atmosphere, like a, like a, somebody who's wearing a suit and a, like an official like skirt or whatever. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like this, this yeah. the office dress I agree. for a woman. I agree. But yeah, I like it. Uh, I'd give it seven point uh, six out of ten. Okay. It's, uh, I like these decimals. Yeah, yeah. I can't. I can't go can't from nine seven, or eight. Seven is a big difference. Seven point two. Eight is like eight point five is like the max I can go. But anyway. Really? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Like six point eight. It's nice. You agree with me, right? It's like very. If you spray this more than twice, it's over. Everybody yeah, in the room yeah. will fucking oh, yeah. smell you, you and only you. you. Yeah. This has to be a very subtle hint. Hmm. That's it. You do not want this smelling strong. It will make everybody in the room dizzy. That's how strong this smell is. Yeah. But it's nice. It's 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 nice. But I don't like perfumes that do, are that strong. So it's uh, whatever I it's said. It's a good it. option. Sure. Okay. Good time in your rotation. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. So this is a Zara Wanted Girl. I never heard of this perfume, but I definitely think it's super strong for mature older women. And I, this smell reminds me of those perfumes that when you know it's Easter time, the men go around to um, spray the girls. This is the spray they use. Um, but it's also the ex it's an expensive kind of smell too. Personally, I wouldn't like it. I wouldn't wear this personally. And the bottle looks like this. The middle one right there. This one? Again, it reminds me of the previous one for some reason. It's very genetic. It's genetic. It's like generic. it's like a, yeah, it's very like um, generic. Generic, sorry, generic. <laughs> it's, generic. it's a very generic one. Uh, I would give it like um, seven out of ten. Very simple one. Something you don't wear every day for sure. It's strong. And I feel like it's definitely somebody who's forty plus. Not 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 a younger audience. Not a younger person would wear this. What you yeah, uh, it's nice. It reminds me of Europe for some reason. It's nice. 7.8 for sure. 7.8. It's very... I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't stand out. It doesn't, uh, you know... Exactly, it doesn't stand out. It, it's good, but it's... I don't know. It's a 7.8. Some... Okay. We'll, we'll deal with it. We'll deal with it. So this was... Lancome La Vie Est Belle. I was really excited to smell this, but yeah, it's nothing special. But it's, it's very pleasant, but nothing special that stands out. Let's go. Wait. Smell it. Smell the. I did already. Oh, smell it. Already. Yeah. All right. Hmm. I like this one. It's very gentle. It's very gentle. Again, kind of feels like oceanic, as Glove says. It's my word. It's oceanic. No, it's oceanic. It's nice. It's pleasant. It's refreshing. Um, nothing against it. I don't know. It's nice. You know, if a girl wore it on a summer day, yeah, hell yeah. I think we'd have a good night. Like, a good date, not a good night. <laughs> good night implies something like else, a, but a good day. You know, I feel like we'd laugh, we'd have some drinks, we'd laugh, we'd make good jokes, you know, it'd be a nice day, maybe your first kiss kind of day. It, it reminds me of that, something like that. It's nice, it's nice. Give me good vibes, that's all. Like a very, uh, so, um, 8.0, we'll give it an 8.0. I like it, I like it. I, I wouldn't mind it on a female. I wouldn't mind it. Yeah, I agree, it's a very pleasant one. Uh, definitely, you don't wear it every day, but, uh, it's a very, again, very like a warm atmosphere. Somebody, some, it's like a summertime kind of cologne, mm -hmm. not cologne, uh, perfume. Mm -hmm. And I honestly, I, it's almost like it's like a unisex one. I feel like mm -hmm. men could wear it too for some reason. Ooh, I don't know. Another just, unisex one, man. Wow. I don't know. I just like it. I like it. I feel like I would wear that too on myself. Damn, you like women's nice. perfume. Can I smell it? Just this one. No, there was another one. Oh, there's another one too before, yeah, but yeah. nice. It's anyway, my my rating. Um, oh yeah, I forgot to ask what your rating I'd was. I'd say yeah, definitely eight out of ten for sure. Eight out of ten. Eight of Both eight. Yeah, it's solid eight. Yeah, yeah, it's a solid eight. eight. Yeah, it's solid Sounds eight. Good. I we all recommend it. Yeah. So actually, I'm really thinking of getting this myself. It is Carolina Herrera Good Girl. It comes in this um, high heel bottle. It's a very sexy perfume. 
my best friend's perfume actually. <laughs> she wears this all the time. Oh. It has coffee notes in it and caramel notes in it. Ooh. Very warm but coffee. sexy. So I think it's a unique scent. Mine, yeah. Yeah, it's yours. Go ahead, have a smell. Coffee beans first, guys, ladies and gentlemen, you gotta remember to do that. Mm. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's okay. That's a oops. Alright, let's go. Okay. It's a unique one, for sure. Not something we smelled before, like not even similar to anything. <laughs> but for some reason it's giving me a very strong alcohol smell. Like I smell alcohol too much. I don't know oh, why. Maybe it hasn't dried down. It's still a maybe. very fresh. Maybe. I don't but know. That's fine. I like it. I like it. It's a very, um, you know, again, it's uh, somebody who, who's around you know, 30, 20, 20 to 30 year old would wear it for sure. And uh, yeah, I'll give it around uh, 8 out of 10 for sure. I like it. Yeah. I think this is, I think this is, I'm pretty sure I'm going to guess without, I think this is the Marc Jacobs one, I think. Might not be, but I think it is. You, you, you understand the brand? No, I think it's the Marc Jacobs one, because I know this perfume. I think, I might be wrong, but it's very nice. Um, it's very similar to the one we spent last time, to be honest. Um, it's not too far different, so again, Would same thing. Would you call thing. it sexy? No, it's definitely not sexy, it's a girl you respect. <laughs> you don't, it's not a girl you bring home on the first date. It's a girl you want to get to know. You want to. It's you, a cute, you, innocent girl. It, it's not a cute, innocent girl either. It's it's a mysterious girl that you potentially want to get to know more. So it's it's you know you're like mm, she has good taste. She's sophisticated. That's what this is. Sophisticated. There we go. That's the word. Sophisticated. It's an eight point two out of ten. Let's go. That I love it. Really good. Yeah. What it did I say? Good. You said eight. eight. Yeah. I okay. think, let's see if it's the Marc Jacobs, I think it's Marc Jacobs. It is! It's Daisy in Love by Marc Jacobs. Oh, Very wow. popular How do you know that stuff? Because everyone wears it. Are you an expert, Marc? I no! Never, I never actually liked it, but now smelling it again, I kind of like it's it. A it's, it's a good one. It's good. It's a good one, it's a good one, it's a good one. I like that one. Yeah, definitely um, one of the best ones. Okay, we have still a few more to go, let's go to the next one. I don't know what this is, but you own this. What? I've smelled this on you before. I um, recognize that too. Yeah, see? She, own, she owns this one. It's, it's nice. It's nice. Um, you own this one, though. So it brings back strong memories, obviously. Um, same with him. He smelled it, so she owns it. And clearly brings back memories. Um, I don't know. It's unique. I like that. It, there's a unique thing about it, which I can't place my finger on, but I like it. It's a, uh, I don't know, it's a 7.7 .7 out of 10. Would I be happy if a girl wore it? Yes. Would I go crazy about it? No. Would I be upset about it? No. But, you know, it is what it is. It's a nice perfume. That's all. That's the best way to put it. It's a nice perfume. That's it. There's nothing, um, I'm pretty sure she owns it though. Mm, smells really nice. For me, it reminds me of like a, a winter day where you would sit inside and just mm. kind of like watch TV, you know, it's cold outside, it's snowing, you go outside and snow and you just like, I don't know. So if you're from a place that doesn't have snow, <laughs> don't, buy it, don't, don't, don't buy this. But that's what, 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 what you know, kind of comes up in my head. So definitely like a, like a winter feeling, but I like it. It's very refreshing. It's not strong and it's pleasant. So huh? yeah, I'll yeah. give it... Um, I'd say 8.2 out of 10. Wow, I think that's Glove's highest. No, he got an 8.5, 8.6 somewhere. Oh, okay, we'll yeah. check later. Anyway, the Versace one, I think we both, um, I think that's our king. It was like queen. So, so this was, guys. You, you have it. I actually don't have this perfume, but I wore it today. Maybe that's why I remember, oh. because I really wanted to try this. I've been wanting this perfume for a while. This is Juicy Couture Vivola Juicy. This very fancy glass. It's a very warm, um, sweet scent. Very popular. A lot of girls wear this to be honest. <laughs> because it's so good. Okay, definitely recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> what? I just don't know what to say. It's. Uh... I love this one. I love this one. Really? 
Yeah, I love I this one. I don't say I love this one, I but love this one. it's a unique one. It says, um... Oh, I love this one. <laughs> to me, it reminds me of some, like, like, like again, like a, like a formal kind of ball, I guess, where people meet and talk and like a venue, like a Los Angeles venue kind of place. You know, you meet some celebrities around, like some cameras <laughs> wow. going. That's what I feel like. Just like uh, you're just famous with this perfume. Yeah, it's a. Uh, wow. I don't know. It reminds me of some. I love this one. You know what this one reminds me of? If you guys ever seen uh, Selling Sunset, the show with the uh -huh. realtors, this they would wear this. This is what they would wear, especially Chriselle. Mm -hmm. I think of Chriselle from Selling Sunset when I smell this, and hopefully she watches this video and agrees. <laughs> Chriselle, you're a sexy woman. Anyway. <laughs> That's what I, th oh, I think Krishal would wear on our date. I give 7.8 out of 10. Okay. 8.2. 8.2. 8. It's a, oh, I love this one. Damn. He loves it. So no, Versace. Versace is still the best. Because it's not better than Versace. And what did I give Versace? Versace, Versace, Versace. Versace, Versace. you give 8.6. I can't give it better than 8.6. Nothing's beaten Versace oh, okay, yet. Okay. Versace is the best. Okay. So this is my favorite perfume ever. Maybe that's why I love it so much. That's the Flower Bomb Victoria oh. Rock. This is so good. It's not bad. Oh, it's sexy. It's, it's good. It's warm. good. Warm. It's the it's a powdery and flowery scent, but not grandma kind of powdery. I agree. It's yeah, yeah. It's powdery. definitely for for younger and it's woman. one spray is enough lasts you the whole day, and you get compliments on this. From everyone, if you wear this, okay. So get this. <laughs> yes. Do it. Do it. Right, Viewers, do it. Do it. Next one. Go. Oh no. No. I think this is somebody who is. Let's smell it. Yeah, terrible. It, it's a weird. It really it's it, it's like a mixture of curry and <laughs> and bubble gum. I don't know how to explain this. It's not what the best the smell. Heck? That's an interesting combo. Yes. Okay. You know what? He's right. There's a spice to it, there's but then a there's a spice. sweetness yeah. to it as well, and it's it's not and working. Little, they don't work. Yeah. Yeah. You know how you have you put you have a glass of water and you pour oil into it. The oil and the water don't mix. It's kind of the same thing. It's it's I don't know what they were. Uh, no. This is a no. This is a two point one. Two point one. <laughs> Draw, I, okay. Crumple it, I don't ever As want to smell it again. Down, I no. really like it. 2.1. It's, it's uh, definitely around 4 out of 10. Okay. Yeah, it's not the best. I think that's your lowest rating yet. Yeah. yeah. Alright, guys. This is the last perfume on the list. The finale. Let's see what they think. Okay, you go first, Mr. P. I really like this one. I really like this one. Mm. Mm. I really mm -hmm. like this one. It's in that Versace, Dolce & Gabbana category. It's up there. <laughs> very fresh. Very, very refreshing. Very smell. fresh. Very refreshing. Summer scent. I think if yeah. you put this on a little bit, I think this is the killer one. Mm. I think if you make this put on a little bit of this, you can't put it on too much, it's strong. But a subtle hit of this to your nose, I think this Ooh, is... Yes. Ooh, oh, I don't know, I don't it's know. A good I one. Like I got through, I, I got a good one. I think this is the winner. We I, left the last this one. This is the, the winner. Time. I'm going to give this a 9.2. This is the winner. Wow. You know what? Okay, I'll let you know at the end. This is oh, I, this is the not, this is the winner. Oh, fuck, I don't know. I feel bad for Versace, but like. Fuck. What about the flower bomb? Flower bomb was good. No, no. See, flower <laughs> bomb. See, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like flower bomb was okay, but like, fuck, like, I don't know, like. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. Oh man, like I don't know, like I this could definitely fall in love with a girl wearing this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I would, I would suggest that I, one. I'd want, if I was a successful CEO and I was taking my wife to the ball, I'd want her to wear this perfume. You can put so many titles to this perfume. Yeah, this is, Cute and innocent, but also... Yeah. It's yeah. everything. Yeah. It's everything. This is 9.2. 9.2. We we found the winner. This yeah. th Whatever this is, that's the winner for me. Okay. For me um, as well. I give a 9.0 out of 10. 9.2. Um, yeah. Very refreshing. Very refreshing. Very like I'd say sexy and elegant at the same time. It's everything. It's all combination in one. And uh, yeah, you know, if you want somebody to to really like you, to really 
I don't know. Remember you? Wear this one. I like I this one. I agree. So, I agree. All right. So we found a winner. This was, again, a Lancome. Guys, I actually made a mistake. You know what I told you for the previous Lancome? That's what I wanted. But this is the one. I Remember I told you, like, that's not how I remember. This is the one. I yeah, smelled it someone one. and it's I had to one. ask because I was like, oh my God, you smell so good. And they said it's Lancome. So this one is Lancome Idol. 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 So I think Idol. I'm going to get that one for myself for 15 ml because I got this perfume sampler and that's what we Do went it. through. I can get a free bottle from... It's a great deal. So Shopper Starfire. So... Once we rank the perfumes, it looks like the guys like Lancome Idol or Idol. I'm not sure how to say the it. The last one, yeah? yeah? That was the first ranking. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave it down below in the comments. Like this video, subscribe, and I'll leave everyone's social media down below. So please follow us. Bye! Let's go! Woo! <laughs>I was like, yeah, I like I like swallowing like five days old uh, underwear that's been farted in like seven days in a row. Okay, okay. okay so anyways. I'm gonna start. Okay. Okay, okay so like your next I like how Victoria noticed everything. What's in my mouth? What? Yeah, it's kind of creepy. Yeah. <laughs> she noticed. Oh, oh. yeah, because I, I saw it right away. I'm like, oh. I noticed three pubes laying on the <laughs> left side of your bathtub, club. <laughs> your pubes are rather curly. <laughs> rather curly. <laughs> rather curly. <laughs> club, do you condition your pubes? Condition. Do you put conditioner on your pubic hair because it's rather curly? <laughs> rather curly. <laughs> Do you think you can get caffeine high from smelling coffee? Do you think instead of drinking coffee you can just keep smelling it and then it'll eventually like wake you up? <laughs> Do you think that's possible? <laughs> Is Billy touching you? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs>